Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Longland on Transport Fever 2. Uh, yeah, so uh, last time around we got Raccoon City hooked up with both goods and uh, fuel because it was convenient, so why not? Uh, so now uh, we've got this last bit of fuel to deliver here. I think I've got everything at Metropolis and Star City here. Now, uh, I believe we've got a rail path to Metropolis already. Um, yeah, so let's... Uh, Let's just kick on the uh, the overlay here. And yeah, so all the... Okay, so we're definitely going to be delivering fuel here. So uh, so I'm going to start out right away uh, with a train. Uh, and then we're going to see how that works out for us. Uh, and we're going to uh, launch it from over here. Uh, like we have been because we know it gets to the fuel place. Uh, so we're going to go with the uh, FD again. And we're going to go... Uh, fuel is going to need uh, these guys. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now I'm going to put four of these on the line. Uh, now I've got a reason for this. And you'll see it uh, in a bit. Uh, because I'm going to only run the one train here, and then I think I'm going to I'm going to put a shunter uh, over at the other side. Okay, no, we'll buy five of them. It's not like we have eleven billion dollars or anything, right? So uh, now we'll just do a new line, which will go from. Uh, where's the fuel thing? Where is the fuel thing? From the fuel thing, yeah. And it will go way over here to Metropolis. Bam. Yes, so it definitely found a path. So we're going to call that uh, Metropolis Metro Metropolis Metro Fuel Delivery. Uh, right, okay. Now, uh, no, we're going to uh, look at this, and we're going to follow the line. It goes up. We're going to make that. Yeah, we're going to make it that color. Okay, so it comes around. It comes down this way. Comes through there. Runs through there. That's going to be a bit of a problem. It runs through Emerald City. It runs down this way. Yeah, it goes exactly the direction I thought it was going to. It comes around through. Okay, yeah, so that's going to actually work. But we do have a bit of a traffic jam here. I think we need to build a bypass here. So I'm going to uh, leave this uh, train window open. And then I'm going to look over here. How can we build a bypass? Now, I think we want to bring the bypass off right about here. E yeah, bring it off between there. Okay, tracks. Uh, okay, so we're going to bring a bypass off like this. I think that's level. Is it? No. Yeah, that is. Okay. Uh, we come out here. Yeah. And then we come in along parallel. Okay, we come in along this way, and then we can bring it around like this. Yeah. Okay, we bring it up like that. I wonder how many trains will reroute, how many lines will reroute onto here uh, after we do this. That is a good question, isn't it? Uh, okay, so we come up to here. Yeah. Uh, okay, now we can bring it off right about here. Now, how is that? 
Well, that is clearly... That's probably not uh, quite what we want. Uh, how is that? Yeah. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll take that. And then that goes into there. And then this comes into here. Yep. And now we can go ahead and do some uh, signaling here, here. Uh, take that one out. Nope. Take that one out. Yep. And then we uh, we need more signals on here. Uh, here. 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 Yep. Then we'll need one here. One. And those other signals will do there. Okay, now, out of curiosity... Yeah, a whole bunch of them shifted over there. Good. Now this one. It shifted over there. Good. So that'll cut some of the traffic through this station. And that's the whole point of that, right? And this is what I mean. Like, the scale of all of this is just wrong. Uh, these things are far too big. The station's far too big. Uh, you know, all of this is far too big for the scale of the map, really. Now, what we can do is we can just jump on here. Um, and I just want to ride this out to uh, Metropolis because, uh, you know, riding the trains is uh, more fun than uh, just building all the time, right? I mean, the whole point of this, at least in my mind at the moment, is a digital model train set, right? Yeah, it works out well as, as that sort of thing, anyway. Right, so uh, what are we going to do uh, at the Metropolis end? Well, once this train arrives, and I've convinced myself that it does arrive, what we're going to do, uh, we're going to do a, a little thing. We're going to take a uh, shunter from uh, uh, Metropolis there, the station in Metropolis, and we'll run it over to... Um, what is it? Star City? Whatever the other one is there. And then this, these trains will do the heavy lifting for delivering all of the, um, all of the fuel into the, uh, into the Metroplex over there. Uh, and that will mean, that'll cut down some of our long haul transport and, uh, it will, of course, um, I need to redo the uh, platform assignments over here, don't I? Yeah, I think I maybe do. Hmm. Or add more platforms. Yeah. No, I need to rejigger this quite a bit to do that, wouldn't I? No, um, anyway. Uh, the whole idea here uh, is we'll run several of these trains here. And they'll, uh, they'll do their thing, right? Um... Uh, getting the uh, the fuel hauled all the way across the map into Metropolis, and then we can just deliver from there. And we'll probably do the same thing with uh, goods in the area. The uh, question is, where do the goods need to come into there? Uh, it might, might just be trucks from uh, from one of the stations to, uh, to the rest of the area there, uh, or to wherever they need to go. Okay, here we don't seem to have a traffic jam, so that's fine. Uh, where are we? Oh yeah, we're around uh, we're around that station. Oh yeah, there's some queuing here, minor queuing. Oh, just because a train was going off to the side, that's why. Uh, we need to wait for the less grunty trains to accelerate. Uh, you know, that's the thing, riding a modern train when you've got less grunty trains ahead of you. If they have to stop, it takes them longer to get up to speed. Especially if you're running empty, and they aren't. Uh, right. That one may just be slower. <clears throat> 
You see, if this was a real uh, network, say say this was in uh, the UK, uh, we'd be chasing yellows here. Uh, yeah. Um, and we'd probably be running uh, slower. Uh, this is what, what one of the stretches where we added all those uh, extra signals that other time here to uh, to clear up the uh, traffic jams, I think. You can tell that because we have electric signals in between semaphores, right? Right, the train ahead of us had trouble climbing the hill, uh, so it slowed down, but we didn't, so we caught up to them. Now, where are... We? Oh, yeah, we're... Right, yeah, because we go through the middle of the town to get to the other track. And I'm leaving it this way because of the geography of that junction, right? That junction is jammed otherwise, but this is relatively light traffic. So we can run the trains through and then get up onto the uh, main track uh, with less complication, right? Yeah, so that, that's why I've left it that way. Like, that's a relatively minor uh, uh, switching operation there. Uh, I really should upgrade those uh, trains with the Nappies wagons on them with uh, Grentier Locos. Uh, that would probably improve my uh, uh, traffic jam issues a little bit on some of these stretches. Yeah, probably would. Uh, no, I'm not going to. Uh, but, uh, you know, I could. No, like a second pass on the trains here would be uh, optimizing everything with when the SD40 is available with the, you know, the grunty diesels or with electrics. Uh, one thing, though, if you uh, upgrade an extensive rail network, here's our bypass, with electrics, uh, all of the uh, catenary poles will... Uh, uh, they're assets that have to be rendered, right? So it'll really tank your frame rate. So we're doing okay right now uh, with frame rate on the map here, but that's partly because we don't have, uh, you know, a million catenary poles all over the place, right? Even with all these trees everywhere. Right, so that bypass certainly avoids uh, one major uh, traffic jam point. Wow, right, we've got six tracks going into the tunnel here. That's uh, that's pretty substantial. Ooh, that looks nice with the uh, viaducts overhead and everything. Uh, I don't think we've ridden under here since I put that track on top. Yeah, I don't think we have. Um, yeah. And then, what, did I use a uh, a flying junction thing up here? I think I did. Yeah, yeah, I did. Uh, we got a flying junction up there. Yeah, I used that to make it more compact than you can do it just by drawing, because everything snapping together causes uh, no end to uh, bother trying to do something like this, right? Uh, okay. Now. Yeah, this is quite densely uh, packed as well. Hmm. Yeah, it's another one of those uh, whole bunch of infrastructure all in one place things. But for the most part, yeah, it, it works okay. That was minor queuing to get through there. Uh, that's another reason to ride your uh, your trains. Uh, you can see where major problems on your network are as well. Uh, now, uh, we we need to we go through one town on the other side of this, right? Yeah, we do. No, this is Metropolis, isn't it? It is. Okay. What is? Uh, uh, where are the... What? Okay. What the... How... It, what? Oh. Well. Uh, 
Yeah, we got to unpick this. I wondered about that when we were uh, in there, going through there earlier. Uh, okay, so let's uh, pause things. Uh, we'll take this signal out. Yeah, and then we'll uh, we'll run. No, get it so you can see what you're doing. Can we get? Yeah, that will snap in there. And we can run this out like this. And on to here. Right? Yeah. Now. Now, this guy, reverse. Right. Okay. So I definitely need to do something else here. Now we're going to, yeah, I need to not put a thing here, I think. Okay. That should unpick that. Um, yeah. Yeah. Not having a signal there is going to keep it from deadlocking. Okay, and where is this guy going? Probably coming in here. Uh, okay, so that guy's leaving. So if we up the tempo and then see what happens here. Uh, this guy's leaving. Okay. He goes out. That guy leaves. No, he stops there. He goes there. One of you guys move already. Where are you going? Raccoon City. Um, oh. Right. Okay, now we need to bring this... What did I do? Okay. What? 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 Do that. Do that. Does it mean too much slow? Do this. Okay. Aha! So I can put a signal, no, if I don't put a signal there, yeah, that's probably better. Okay, I think we've unpicked it. Yeah, I think we've unpicked it. Uh, where are you going? What? Why did it do that? Um, yeah. Well, we'll do that so that there's at least another uh, track there that can uh, let things do things. Uh, it got us unstuck anyway. Now... Let's uh, let's go down to uh, Metropolis. Now we need to get uh, stuff up into Star City here, and we're going to do that with a little shunter. Now to do that, we're going to need a uh, a platform over here. Now we can get that easily. Uh, we just need to uh, attach some tracks to the station. Oh, uh, we need to get rid of that. Right, and then we attach some tracks. Um, we can take that and that out. And we can put that there. Yeah, and then we can... Well, actually, we can take that out and we can grab a cargo building. And we can put it right here. Yeah. Yeah, we can do exactly that. Okay. 
Now, that gives us uh, something that we can do there. Now, we just need to get uh, the tracks out of here, the track out of here. Uh, running it straight seems like the thing to do. Um, that doesn't seem like the thing to do, does it? Uh, no, it doesn't. I built an I built an underground station here, didn't I? Uh, right. Okay, so if we come across like this, uh, what if we do this? No, that doesn't work. Okay. Well. Um. Okay, well, we can come across like this, where that's not too egregious, right? And then we can come across like this, where it's also not too egregious. Yeah. And do that, where it's also not too egregious. Uh-huh. Well, if we turn that into... Uh, turn that into this one. Yeah. Do that. Yeah. Okay. I think that's what I want uh, coming out of there. Uh, now, can we can we get a uh, dual track through here? I think we, yeah, we can. Okay. Well, why don't we? Starting here. Yeah. This is one of those spots where you get uneven crossings if you did it the traditional way. I do that. I'm holding shift so, to stop the snapping there. Uh, okay. So that's low clearance, but it's acceptable. Uh, okay. So we've got out of uh, Metropolis with our shunter. Now... Uh, where do we want to put the uh, the station? Oh, we can slow this down. Uh, in Star City. Oh, okay. This is where the uh, the goods are coming to. Okay. So we probably want a. Uh, two, two track station. Probably right about in the middle here. Okay, so if we take that out, and then we go ahead and uh, try to put our uh, station in there. We, yeah, that's not going to work terribly nicely, is it? Uh, actually should work just fine if I do it there yeah and then we go in here configure it put a cargo building on the other side yeah that covers enough that we're we're good there now we just need to get uh, a line out of here too and I still built it with the catenary uh, yeah because of course I did uh, right, so we're going to go in tools, we're going to go in there, we're going to turn that off, yep, and then we're going to go on tracks, and we're going to build more tracks, and we're going to make this flat, coming out of here, okay, now we come out of here this way, and we come out of here this way, yep. Um, do we, do we just go for a, uh, level crossing here? <laughs> we could. I think, I think I will. Uh, because there's no way we're going to, uh, get up high enough fast enough, is there? 
Uh, no. No, there really isn't. Not if we want to keep those uh, roads. Yeah. Okay, so we'll do that. Okay, come on. Why don't we just go straight? Yeah. No. Do that. Uh, and do this too. No, don't do that. No. Do this. Okay. Yeah. Okay, now we need to get our uh, uh, crossings so they're not horrible. I'll put the diamond in there. Uh, do that. Do that. Uh, wang that stuff together just like that. There we go. We've wanged it together. Now we should be able to fit a diamond in here. Yep. Okay. Now we've got a diamond crossing. So we've got that. Uh, right. We can connect this. Uh, what? Okay. Now here's how you signal one of these. Uh, okay. Uh, you do it with a signal on the way in on all four directions so that you don't ever end up blocking it with conflicting trains and we need one of those okay now we need to get through here and up onto there uh, and that's looking like an underground project to get past Gotham uh, okay so if we well, maybe maybe we just go up and around like this through the mountain. Yeah, I think we just go through the mountain. Just like that. Oh, that should be fine. Um, that's even acceptable. Okay. Well, why don't we do that then? Uh, that's a fairly long tunnel, but it is a mountain. So, uh, yeah, I think it's acceptable. Now, we come out there. Now, we need to come from here, where we are up in the air already, so we can get across, just like that, just like that, yeah, so we can get across the, uh, the road, and then we just need to, where does it come out? There. Uh, okay, so we can come in like that. We might want to viaduct that. Yeah, we do. Okay. Well, we'll do that. Okay. Well, that will let us run our shunter here. So, uh, we need to finish signaling it. Um, okay. We'll probably do it just like this, right? Uh, probably like that. Uh, yeah, a couple there. A couple there. A uh, couple here, and one here, yeah. Okay, now, how am I going to get a uh, train onto here? That is a question. Um, that's going to require a depot somewhere that we can access. Um, you know what? Uh, what we can do... Uh, we can make sure we can get uh, uh, trains on here by building this. Yep, that will do it. Okay, now where is the nearest depot going back this way? Could be that one. Um, I think it will be that one. Okay, so we can bring a track off of here. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's not horrid. 
uh, over to here. Yep. Uh, bring it up past the signal and do this. Yes, okay. Now we will, no, we will do a signal there so that the train can launch easier uh, like that. Okay, yes. Now, uh, we should be able to do this without anything exploding now. This we don't need, I don't think, uh, an extraordinary uh, powerful uh, loco. So let's use the Alco. Um, and then we're going to go for cargo and we are doing fuel here. So we'll grab the tank car. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's uh, that's actually okay. Um, so we'll buy that new line. Uh, where is the Metropolis business? Uh, we go from here to here. Yeah, and this is going to be the Metropolis fuel shunter yeah right that's the metropolis fuel shunter now uh if we go in here no if we go in here do that yep now let's just uh ride this there's a little bit of jumpiness in the frame rate here uh, this is going to be the end of this episode with the uh, fuel delivery thing. I just want to see that uh, that track setup. You can get a better feel for how it uh, how it works uh, by doing a uh, first person ride. Um, yeah, so that uh, that wasn't my original plan. Uh, I hit on this when I was uh, launching the train to Metropolis. Uh, I was originally going to deliver to the central station between all the cities there and use trucks, but I decided that that wasn't, uh, that wasn't going to be the uh, best option here. Or at least it wasn't going to be the option I was going to use. Yeah, here we go. Now we're on our new track. We come through here, and the stuff will build along there. We've got this. right well we're going fast enough for the length of this line so there's that now here's our uh, tunnel through the mountain yep when you have 11 billion dollars it's pretty easy to do this sort of thing and here we here's our uh, four-way level crossing and then we come on into star city right and then we can go back again this uh, four-way crossing isn't as level as I'd like it, but it will do. Yeah, that's not bad. Uh, I'm, I'm okay with it. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely okay with it, how this uh, this set up. Good. And we've got all this stuff built up right beside the uh, tracks here. Uh, all that jazz. Uh, yeah, so that stuff will fill in nicely. Um, yeah. Yep. It's all, it's all good. Uh, so that definitely uh, worked out exactly like I'd hoped. So what that means now is we need to deliver goods to Star City right yeah there's nothing up in the corner there uh we've already done goods to raccoon city uh, right yeah so we got one goods delivery there uh we need goods to cityville 
Yep. So two goods deliveries. Emerald City doesn't need goods. Uh, so we got two goods deliveries. Uh, we need goods to Chester's Mill. That's three. Uh, we need goods to Mega City 1. That's four. And we need goods to Avalon. That's five. So we have five more uh, deliveries to do uh, for goods. And then I think that's all the cargo. Um... Uh, I think, um, and uh, then, uh, well, actually, if we check the uh, town statistics, um, right, um, uh, cargo, no, uh, Okay, so we've got those all have deliveries. We've just pork belly doesn't have fuel. Okay, uh, pork belly and Raccoon City don't have fuel. No, we definitely. Uh, where's uh, where's pork belly? Are we delivering fuel to pork belly? Um. No, we aren't. Nope, there's one more fuel delivery to do. Pork belly. Okay. Uh, and Emerald City. Yeah, that has fuel coming in. Uh, Raccoon City. Uh, we definitely did a fuel delivery here, right? Yeah, we did. Okay, so we have a fuel delivery to do in Pork Belly. And then... Uh, yeah, that's going to be an interesting one to do. Uh, not so much. We drop it off here. And then truck it in. Like, presumably, we're doing with uh, food. Sort by the other cargo. Um, food. Hill Valley. Oh, we need food to Hill Valley as well. Um, yeah. Okay. Well. Uh, I'll have to make sure to check on that. But, yeah. Yeah. Uh, We've got seven more deliveries to do, I guess. So we're looking at um, four to seven episodes, I think, to finish the cargo deliveries. Uh, so that should finish out the year. And then, uh, you know, if we're doing two a week, that, that should finish out the year. And then uh, maybe I'll come back, uh, call it, you know, the end of the season or something like that, and come back with a different map in the new year. Uh, the, uh, the developers, uh, 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 Urban Games, have uh, said that uh, there's uh, an update coming for Transport Fever 2. At least they've said it's for Transport Fever 2 anyway. That's going to have some interesting uh, developments, assuming they end up making what they suggest that they're making. So uh, how long that takes to come out, who knows? I might stick with this map a bit longer. Um, depending how things go maybe into the new year i'll do passengers call that season two or something like that um but anyway once i get all of the cargo connected up i think i'll upload the map to the workshop uh just up upload it to the steam workshop and then anybody who wants to if they're you're following the series you can pick up the map and uh, go through and go hey, look at what that idiot did and then uh, uh put your money where your mouth is and do better right um, but anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this episode. Next episode, we come back and we do some other uh, deliveries and uh, work our way toward finishing all the cargo. Um, anyway, uh, that's all for now. So like, comment, and subscribe. You know, that usual business that everyone wants you to do. 
Uh, I'll do you one better. You can dislike as well. Yeah, like you need my permission for that, but it's not going to hurt my feelings any. So go ahead. You know, if you feel like doing that, do that. You know, it's, it's entirely up to you. And of course, the bell. If you enable that, uh, you might get some notifications from YouTube and you may find those useful. Uh, or maybe you don't. It's entirely up to you again. Uh, and I guess that said, see you back next time.